Hey everyone, thank you so much for tuning in. This is Kyle Grantham with River Geeks. Uh, I want to thank you so much for your time today and today we're just going to go over uh, bringing in USGS terrain data through the um, through RASMapper and so this is a fairly new tool it was released and I believe it was version 6.2 so it's fairly new and so today we're just gonna get started and before we get started I want to uh, make sure you like and subscribe to our YouTube channel River Geeks so this is all I've done is set the projection so that's one of the first things you want to do is set that projection and I brought in a shape file for reference and so what we're gonna do is we're gonna want to download that data and so we're just gonna set it to our current view and so you'll see the different cell size 1 meter 10 meter and 30 meter we're gonna go with 1 meter because it's just more detailed and so you'll see it's right at a tile divide so we're just going to download both of those and so what it does it creates its own folder its own terrain folder once you download this and so i'm just going to keep the default folder and so we're going to start that download and so this could this may take a couple minutes All right, so it finished, and what we're going to do now is this going to pop up where that, where it is in the folder location. So what we're going to do now is we need to create a new RAS terrain, and we'll need to bring those DMs in. Yes. 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 One meter. Save. And so, one thing to note here is your file is in it. It's in meters. Um, if we want that in to feet, you'll have to use the conversion meters to feet. So we're just going to create that. And there you have it. And with that, thank you so much for following along today. Uh, we'll be putting out some more content here soon. I've got three words for you. Like the video.